Fat grafting from one part of the body to another is increasingly used in reconstructive surgery, for example, in breast augmentation. However, resorption rates range from 25% to 80%. This new study in The Lancet looks at improving graft viability by adding stem cells to the graft. Healthy participants underwent two liposuctions taken 14 days apart, one to extract the stem cells, known as adipose-derived stem cells, or ASCs, and another for the preparation of fat grafts. The fat-derived stem cells are isolated and culture-expanded in an approved laboratory. ASCs are harvested after 14 days of culturing. Two purified fat grafts were prepared for each participant. One was enriched with ASCs, the other served as a control. ASC and control grafts were randomized and injected under the skin of the upper arm. Each participant received two grafts, one to the right and one to the left arm. MRI was taken immediately, then at 121 days to measure residual fat volumes, showing a difference of 16% versus 81% for the ASC-enriched grafts. Survival of the grafts was assessed by removing the transplants and preparing them for histological examination. This study found that ASC-enriched fat grafts had much higher residual fat volumes than control grafts, 23 cm3 versus 4.7 cm3 in residual fat volumes after 121 days. These results suggest lipofilling may be a reliable alternative to major tissue augmentation.